What I want to know is, is why isn't anyone talking about the real shortage? And I'm talking about the gold shortage. Hello everyone, welcome back once again. SB here. Thanks for stopping by. I really do appreciate you guys watching this video. Now, if this video is something that you enjoy, make sure you hit that like button before you leave. I'd really appreciate that. Now, in this video, guys, we're going to talk about the real shortage, the shortage that I'm seeing here locally, which is where I source all my precious metals. Now, depending on how you purchase, you may be seeing something totally different. We all live in different areas of the world. So locally, right, this is where I source all of my precious metals. I'm seeing a shortage on gold. That's right, gold. I'm seeing a gold shortage. Not really seeing a silver shortage at all. Now, I went into my LCS last week. I bought a silver eagle like this. I bought two of them. And then I also bought a proof silver eagle as a gift for someone else. Now, I started looking around because I just couldn't help it. So, literally, he had tons of maples, okay? Canadian maples. Literally had tons of silver eagles. Tons of 10-ounce bars. 5-ounce bars. 100-ounce bars. Junk silver, Morgan dollars, peace dollars, you name it, man. He had it. He has it in stock. So if you are having a hard time finding some silver, let me know. I will put his information down in the description below for you guys to maybe possibly work something out. I don't know if he ships or anything like that. I, I really do not know. I will ask him next time that I go in there. But as far as silver goes, he had a ton of silver. So the premiums, of course, are, are real high on silver. So I went over to go see if he had some gold in stock that I've been you know, trying to find. And literally, he had one quarter ounce American Gold Eagle, right? And he literally had one one ounce American Gold Eagle. No maples, no libertads, no Britannias no big gold bars none of that he just had small denominations or grams and whatnot he had literally had more platinum eagles in stock platinum eagles than he did american gold eagles or maples or anything like that and if you know anything about platinum it's hard to find so that was kind of mind-blowing okay let that sink in platinum is very hard to find in regards to gold in regards to silver it's very hard to find in the fact that he had more platinum in stock that should that should be pretty concerning to you guys as far as gold now looking online at the online buoyant dealers normally you know whenever it's normal times they have pages upon pages of options to choose from and we're just not seeing that as well so I'm wondering if this is something that was taking place is if I'm wondering if people are playing the GSR, especially here locally. I, I probably should have asked him whenever I went in there because it's like like I said, man, there's tons of silver in there, but there's not a lot of gold. Now, the GSR right now is in the, the, the 60s and it has been consistently for quite some time. Things like these silver eagles, like these backdate silver eagles, you go look online and and these are are forty dollars plus right and and there's nothing special about it. they're meant in the millions right there's there, you know there's nothing special about these but the fact that you could probably sell these right and be inside that 50 gsr range that's a good trade up for gold range and i'm wondering if that's what's taking place here locally and i'm wondering what you guys are finding in your neck of the woods because Quite frankly, this is kind of shocking to me, not being able to source gold. So the U.S. Mint is producing more gold and silver than it has in almost probably a decade. And the fact that I cannot find even today's bullion in gold, that's shocking. OK, people aren't selling their gold. People are gobbling it up, buying it up in bulk. So the mines right now they're they're working as hard and as fast as they can to bring new gold to market and it's, it's a struggle 
Now, this is not a mining video, okay? So this is just a, a shortage that that should be talked about, that should be spoken about. And the fact that it is very hard to find locally and online should be a warning to you guys out there. So let's go online. Let's see what we can find online and see if it's feasible for buying. All right, so here we are. We are on bullionexchanges.com. It's one of the websites I like to use uh, probably the most outside of, of buying locally. And they normally have a good selection as far as gold, silver, or, or whatnot. And their, their shipping is, is pretty good right now. It's, it's long, only like a three-day delay. So let's go take a look at their, their gold that they have in stock. Now, <clears throat> depending on what type of gold you're looking for, uh, let's let's look at, uh, let's, let's see. Let's look at gold coins and see what they have available. And whenever you do it this way, it'll bring up all the sizes. And yeah, you could buy the grams, two pesos, uh, tenth ounce. Yeah, they're they're kind of high, but the premiums on your small fractional gold right now, guys, they 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 are what they are, right? Okay, so if you're having a hard time sourcing gold, then then here you go. Now here is a quarter ounce random year American Gold Eagle. That's actually not a bad price right now. 531 if you pay by check so technically that's pretty decent right now uh pretty good deal right there and i don't know how many they have in stock i guess i could have entered a quantity but i did not do that so they have a 2021 it's a couple dollars more uh let's see some numismatics half ounce american gold eagles probably my favorite design to buy right now they do have those in stock so a thousand sixteen dollars now let's look at here we go your your one ounce gold commemoratives now these are your probably your best deal as far as gold coins okay so don't sleep on these uh designs are varied and, <laughs> and the purity is a little different as well but here is your canadian maples uh your your britannia your krugerrands so they got a pretty good selection as far as gold now uh the, the 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 prices you know like on your buffalo or your, man they're high right so you know your options aren't extremely huge like compared to years past right where you can go to a website and you can essentially pick whatever gold coin you're looking for so let's do this let's go back and we're going to check out and see what type of uh, gold bars that they have in stock. So I did not see any gold Kruger, Kruger, uh, kangaroos in there as well. Come on, let's check out their gold bars. So yeah, here we go, gold bars. Great premiums on gold bars, guys. Uh, if that's your thing, man, then, and like I said, it's one of the better ways to buy gold. I just, I can't get into them, but I know there are, you know, people out there who are gold bar fans and this one right here, it's probably one of the better designs, you know, it's it's a very pure gold bar and this one there's no queen on it. So you guys got no excuses on this, right? You know, a lot of people say I'm not buying anything with the queen on it. I have no issue with her whatsoever. Uh but if if you're looking for a good low premium gold this is a great way to go because it's got excellent security features and it's very pure if that is something that you're into. And it comes in assay. So I'm just not a fan of it, but I do like this design. I just don't like gold bars, really. Uh, I, I just like uh, I like round things better. So let's take a look at their other options and then uh, we'll go back. Let's see. All right. So yeah, you can go to all gold products and check out see what they have as well and it'll break it all down the gold bags uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna buy any of those but they are cool and and I know and see right here guys a lot of people say I cannot afford to buy gold and with with options like these you know you buy two silver eagles that, that's pretty much the same price right there 
right? It's for a gram of gold. So just just food for thought. I know a lot of people, they, they made that comment, dude, I can't afford to buy gold. It's, it's just not feasible. Well, here you go. There's one of your options. But yeah, uh, I'm not seeing a great amount of gold out there. Bullion Exchanges probably has the, the biggest selection outside of Atmex that I can find. And really, they're they're pretty, pretty limited as well. So not a lot of options to choose from nowadays as far as gold. And, and I just think that this shortage on gold is, is not being reported on correctly. And uh, I just wanted to shed some light on that. Well, I really appreciate you guys watching this video today, guys. Remember, this is not a race. Okay, stack at your own pace. All right, that's going to do it for today. Keep grinding on your stack.